I encourage you to always be curious, always seek out things you love, and always work hard once you find them. The Lakers, as most of us already know, are on the path to repeat as defending champions with their two superstars on LeBron and Anthony Davis, who has barely played together much this season due to injuries. Going to the playoffs, it looks as if the Lakers, before even going to the first round, will have to get through the playing tournament first, unfortunately. So the path to repeat just got that much tougher. And having LeBron and AD, this time just might not be enough, and they're gonna need something more. The Lakers do have a good mix of role players in Dennis Schroeder, Montrezl Harrell, Alex Caruso, and especially in their newly equipped big man, Andre Drummond. But even with this, the Lakers have a secret weapon underneath their sleeve that most of the NBA has forgotten. He's a rising star and we unfortunately do not recognize it because he is overshadowed by the superstars on this team. But if you watch this game, then you just know how great he is. And no, it's not Kyle Kuzma, although I'm not dismissing his talent. His name is Taylor Horton Tucker. Taylor Horton Tucker, because he is not the focus of the Lakers offense as they are in straight championship mode, his talent has barely been put to use as he is only 20 years old and this Lakers team is filled with veterans and guys who have had their years in the league. So a kid THT's age just doesn't mesh well. But that does not replace the fact that every night the Lakers have a gem sitting on the bench. THT just recently in a win over Houston dropped 23 with 10 assists in a win without LeBron and AD. He also has a game this season April 19th against the Jazz dropping 24 points as well. What makes this all the more impressive is that he is not a focus of the offense. He is just a scorer out there making it work. Watching his game, you can witness the greatness in his talent and creativity, and he is never scared of the moment. As we saw the other night against the Knicks, he had the game winning shot to give the Lakers the lead. As a young player, his confidence is through the roof, and maybe that's just because he's playing on a great team or because he's paired up with LeBron. But either way, not getting enough minutes or not being a central focus of the team does not stop him. He's extremely confident, and when he gets those moments, he delivers and sometimes has to go out of his way to create those moments. Watching THT, you can already see how gifted he is handling the ball and his mid-range. His evasiveness when it comes to driving in is second to none. It almost resembles a young D-Rose, or in terms of degree of difficulty of some of the shots he makes with a hand in his face, it's almost like Kobe. Given the minutes, THT could absolutely be terrifying. And playing in that two-guard position, he has already shown his talent in passing the ball, whether that's a transition or driving to the basket and dishing it out. THT is simply a baller, and it sucks because if it were almost any other team in the league, we will witness it, but unfortunately, that's not the case. However, you can hide the talent, but you can't diminish it. Over the past five games of which Taylor Horn Tucker has had solid minutes, he is shooting from the field 52%, averaging 6.5 assists to go with roughly 16 points per game, which is solid for a 20-year-old on a team that really isn't suited for him, but yet he still can produce. Although THD has struggles from the three this season, in which I believe he will easily be able to adjust that in the near time future, he has shown there is no way he cannot score the ball. He is an excellent finisher with great vision. He knows how to fly by defenders, as I already mentioned. And his handles aren't necessarily like Kyrie or Curry, it's more like a Jamal Crawford with his lengthy arms that makes his crossovers more deadly. And if you watch his game, you know just what I'm talking about. He can hit almost any mid race shot with a hand in his face and can score off the pass on a pull up, fade away, and make anything possible. THT is no joke, and while teams face the Lakers with the hopes of stopping AD and LeBron, we forget that they have this young player who has dynamic scoring abilities on the bench. THT is a gifted talent just sitting on the bench for the Lakers, but can absolutely be a deadly scorer if put to use. His potential from what we have seen so far is through the roof, and players on this team have raved about him countless times. There's no telling how great he can be or really is because as long as he's on the Lakers, at least with AD and LeBron as the stars, he may not have that limelight and may have to find his way on a different team. But if that's what it takes for the world to notice THT, then that's just what's going to happen. But the Lakers, as I mentioned already, have a gem sitting on the bench and they need to take advantage of it sooner than later. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about this. Don't forget to follow me on my Instagram and I'll see you guys later.